importantly was that these messages that were research-based and put into modules needed to be delivered by people who were deeply admired and respected within each culture. Only with the people that they trusted would the young people listen in a way that we wanted them to. And lastly, the materials needed to be free. That was also something we didn't know. When we first did the testing, we had created some very good materials that cost a little bit of money, and some other materials that we were testing to see that were a bit inferior that were free, just to see what human behavior would do. And what we found was that in almost every case, people wanted the free materials every time. So we knew we needed to create the most effective materials and that they had to be available for free and they had to go into the schools. I was fortunate to grow up in a family of entertainers with my father being a brilliant animator. So combining the design elements with research felt natural. Teach Aid spun out of Stanford in 2009. At the time, the materials were in five countries. And today, we're so happy to say that they're now used in 82 countries around the world. Being of Indian origin, it was especially important to take the situation in India very seriously and work with the many talented people across the East and West to join efforts and arm together to be able to create these materials for the children. The past several years working in India has been an incredible journey. I have met some of the kindest and most intelligent people in the world. Hundreds of, peoples have, have, hundreds of people have donated hundreds of thousands of hours to be able to make this dream come true for not just India, but other places. Through the journey, I found incredible leaders and a dear sister in Miss Amala Akinini as we faced and overcame many challenges together. There were other very invaluable people whose support was incredibly meaningful, like Mr. Barthasarthi and Mr. Jayesh Ranjan, who have provided incredible information, support, and guidance through the process to take this work forward, not just to the children of India, but also to the last mile. And the media, all of you, have become our dear allies to take this information forward and educate people directly. For this, we are eternally, eternally grateful to you. This is my last trip to India. I am depending on all of you <laughs> for this work. This is my last trip to India for this work, <laughs> HIV work. And I'm depending on all of you, my dear friends in the media, to please take this on as your own issue. Because once I'm gone, the work, it can be forgotten. I'm depending on each and every one of you to take this on as your own project and bring it for the people, for our children. Having roots in India, it has been such a tremendous honor to bring the expertise that I have to help the children and this country feel so connected, that I feel so, so immensely connected to, and further to be able to do the work for the children. Thank you for this opportunity, and thank you again for all of your support. It's you that are the voice of the people, and it's you that will be able to take it to them in the end. Thank you. Good afternoon, everyone. Um, friends from the media, Mr. Jay Ranjan, Secretary Information Technology Government of Telangana. Thank you for being with us today. Mr. Partha Sarathi, uh, Secretary Agriculture and Cooperation Department, Government of Telangana. Thank you for being with us. And ladies and gentlemen, I'm sure you will feel um, deeply moved listening to Dr. Pia Sarkar speak. On behalf of Teach Aids and Dr. Pia, Thank you for being here with us. Today is a very, very special day. It's the culmination and the conclusion of a six-year journey. Um, I wear many hats, and today I'm wearing the hat of Trustee Teachers India Trust. Um, as uh, you just heard, uh, I met Pia Sarkar and became part of Teachers 
since 2009, uh, when we found that valuable HIV education material was not available for us school children. Um, so Nagarjuna and myself had been part of the HIV awareness drive along with the government agencies, AP SACS, Telangana SACS, in bringing uh, understanding about HIV to uh, the people of the Telugu speaking states. And so when children with HIV were expelled from schools in 2009, uh, we had been part of a public debate where many members of the media, maybe some of you here uh, present here, would also have been part of the debate to bring a better understanding to school managements and parents and teachers that uh, it was perfectly fine for their children to study with HIV positive kids. In fact, it was very essential that they learn to grow up in a world with HIV. And uh, so it was, it was God sent when Dr. Pia Sorkar came with her module and requested Nagarjuna to give his voice. Uh, since then, at that time we found that sadly the only time people found out that they had HIV was when they were going for their tests during the, uh, the pregnancy test. And um, so this material when Nimagadda Foundation funded the pilot project and Dr. Pia Sarkar prepared the Telugu version, it was released in 2011, end, that was also World AIDS Day it was released and AP SACS, Telangana SACS widely distributed it to um, schools, government schools, from where children grew up, uh, children accessed the knowledge um, to uh, empower themselves so that they wouldn't have that rude shock during their pregnancy test to find out whether they were HIV positive or not. So students today who have access to um, the internet and to say private education or education which has online access, they may be more informed. But what about children who don't, who can't afford to go to the schools that have this kind of access? These children benefit greatly from the Teach Aids materials being distributed by the government agencies. So Dr. Pia Sarkar has, as you have seen, has very painstakingly researched the material. Um, just a celebrity giving the information is not enough. Uh, if it was an educator giving the information, very often we found, and even till date we find, if a teacher is talking about it, they tend to put their own interpretation, they pen tend to add their own dogmas, they, their own morality, and therefore they close the doors to value, uh, valued science-based fact and knowledge which the children could can access through Teach Aids material. So Teach Aids has eliminated that process of um, coloring the material available. Every single person who has been part of this project, be it the government agencies, be it the NGOs, be it the animators, our donors, our celebrities, um, members of the media, everybody has come forward understanding the value of what we are doing today. No child in the world, let alone in India, no child in the world needs to grow up and get infected with HIV and lose their immunity systems out of a lack of knowledge. They deserve to be empowered with this basic life skill of understanding how to protect themselves from HIV and how to grow up in a world with HIV. It doesn't matter what cutting age treatment is available and it doesn't matter whether there's a cure or not. Nobody needs to get infected with this virus. And it is with this intention that the material is now available for free. I am so grateful to every single person who has come forward and helped. Shades. I'm grateful to Pia for taking so many years of her life to um, research and provide this material. And today that it's out in the open and it's available for free, I request each and every one of you here today to access this information and, and circulate it as wide as you can.
year after, not just for World AIDS Day, but every so that every young person in India grows up with access to understanding how to protect themselves from HIV. I am fortunate that uh, I have been associated with this project right from 2011. I still remember the days of my joint collectorship in the district of Waranga. I took a lot of interest in HIV prevention program right from 2003. In fact, I spoke to Srimati Damayanti and requested one thing. Damayanti, give me this project. I will implement it in Waranga with my you know, full energy and putting my whole heart and uh, you'll see the impact. She happily gave that project to me. That was known as Adolescent Education Program, which was one of the very important components of HIV prevention program. I spent a lot of time on this program. In fact, uh, I used to train the teachers, the lecturers, the trainers of the trainers. Every day, at least two hours I used to spend on this program. And that experience has also brought some of the problems in reaching out to these children, the adolescent children. Though technically, the adolescence is defined as something transition from puberty to adulthood in human development. It is that age, very, very sensitive age, very delicate age, and that is ripe and right age for reaching out as far as HIV prevention is concerned. Because at that age, the children cannot really appreciate what is the risk, what is the risk level, what is the importance of HIV prevention? Really, it's a very tough task for that age. Though I used to train hundreds of teachers in all secondary schools, and as part of Red Ribbon Club those days, I used to train lecturers. Some I found something was missing. We are really not catching the pulse of the students. That vacuum was you know, just reminded me when uh, Dr. Pia approached me in 2011 when I took charge as project director AP Sachs. This, I can say, duo, Dr. Pia and Amalagar, both are responsible for uh, these things, reaching this logical end of this project. But for Amala's support, Dr. Pia could not have succeeded. That's my personal feeling. Because mobilizing celebrities right from Anushka to Amitabh Bachchan is not a ta small task. And Amala Garu and Nagarjuna Garu, they were you know, standing you know, strong behind her for mobilizing all these celebrities. I still remember those days when uh, Dr. P.A. used to come to me, then uh, I was acting as facilitator, in fact, all these years. Though I am no more project director right from 2011, 2013, I was associated with this project as a facilitator. Whenever Dr. P.A. came to India, whenever she came to Hyderabad, she was getting in touch with me, then I was talking to so it may be state, aid control society, Maharashtra, or any other state, and I used to facilitate. HIV, AIDS, low jari nanta mass campaigns. I think in the country, this is the AM the This is known to all our media friends. Mass campaigns. In fact, initial years, 90s law, when NACO was started, when the state aid control society was started, when people used to ask project directors and SACS staff, what is that you are doing? They were saying only we are doing awareness, nothing else. By that time, even ART drug was also not there. There was no information with regard to ART drugs 
now we have ART drugs. One of the important challenges and the Karakrim Muttamlo Chala important challenge Bharat Desan Lo Yantante Stigma and Discrimination, Vivaksha. Yaprete Manam initial campaign law HAV AIDS Sanagane Idoka Bhayan Karamayana Vayadi Idoka Mahamari and slogan to Nepalite Mudanetamo Diniki Karano Langikanga Una Samandhara Nepalite Chapremo Aruzuruchi HAV AIDS Mida Our campaigns themselves were responsible for developing stigma and discrimination in the society. As a prajalu, virus no shatru da bavi chakunda, varu, yavarete, manishuli, e virus ava inchindo, walani shatruga bavi chalam, no letter. That was a very, very unfortunate situation. Stigma and discrimination, vivaksha, that is the first enemy of HIV AIDS in our country, not only in our country, various other developing countries. 98 law, Maradeshan law, HIV prevalence 2.18%. When I was joint collector Anantapu, being a biology student, why I took up the cause of HIV prevention effort as joint collector, it caught my attention. I felt in 2003 when the prevalence level at that point of time was 1.64%. I thought I am sitting on a balcony. What is this? Such a huge population in the country. Koti Irvai, Nuta Irvai Kotla, Janabagala, Manadeshalo, is Samasa Nizanga, African Deshalo, Ede Teman of Chedo, Anupo, Tusamo, Ade Anupo Gunka, Manabara Deshalo, Manaki, Daridra Mose, Elavuntundi, Elanti, Dushparitalo, Manadeshalo, Untaani. Just we were frightened in 2003. And there was some HIV prevention Apanuchi. It was very close to my heart, this work. And there was some post this work I was closely monitoring. HIV law unneed can appear the challenge in today. Teenage Vice Law on a Pillalaki church. In the country, my life skill education and adolescent education program law. But I need to get a book in the end of the day. The next summer is a great day. I saw a pillar key. What a brother. I'm going to get a little bit of a pillar. It's a very, very, very sensitive age. Memo teachers keep training. It's a puppy. Teachers who classes. This could all look. Oh, sorry. Good. Well, to see only science teachers. Biology teachers, teachers ni, mem training itu ada malu betul. Lapan leh tu mungkin tu walani. Walai na kasih tu dahir yang gaya ishak urut cuma terteran. They also failed. Ok, sorry. Hcv saman ni cina syllabus. Ok, lesson gula gula pa, pa dia am shallow ok, dipuskalo. They used to even skip teachers. That was the level of the or magnitude of the problem those days. Atuan ti samai ullo. That still a vacuum and in a mind on the and goes on dr. Pia a play day 2011 low PD and in the chart this for another picture of a play the animated video to say more the advantage in today animated formats they attract the attention of these children and the Kyogana Montundi on the last time the digital Telangana and the Chalo Ka Brehad Mena Karikram Nadustaundi ये कार्यक्रम बागंगा माना राष्ट्रम लोन 28 इनमें दी वेल एडू मतलब या भाई ग्राम पंचायत लो वो का डिजिटल कियोस को वो का डिजिटल सेंटर में मेरे पार्ट चेस्टु नमो प्रति सेंटर आ ग्रामों लो उनकी वस्तु ना वो का स्थानिक महिला अधवर्यम लो नडुस्तुंडी मुख्य अंगा ये डिजिटल सेंटर द्वारा प्रबुद्धो स so, we have to use T-Chats material to use the first time that we have to use the T-Chats to use the T-Chats HIV AIDS prevention to use the animated videos to use the first time that we have to use the T-Chats to use the T-Chats to use the T-Chats to use the content to 
చాలా వాళ్ళు లోతుగా చాలా రీసెర్చ్తో చాలా పరిశోధనతో చేశారు తర్వాత యానిమేషన్ వాడుకోవడం వల్ల ఇది చూడడంలో ఎవరికి ఇది ఏదో నీరసంగా ఏదో బోరింగ్గా ఏదో అవుతా ఉంది అట్లాంటి కూడా అభిప్రాయం ఉండదు చాలా సరదాగా చాలా ఎంజాయ్మెంట్తో వాళ్ళు ఈ ఇవన్నీ చూసుకు చూసుకుంటూ మరి ఒక పక్క దాంట్లో ఉన్నటువంటి కొన్ని ముఖ్యమైన సందేశాలు కూడా వాళ్ళు గ్రహించుకోగలుగుతారు వాళ్ళు దాన్ని అంతర్లీనం చేయగలుగుతారు కాబట్టి డిజిటల్ తెలంగాణలో కూడా ఈ శిక్షణ కార్యక్రమం ఇట్లాంటి చాలా ముఖ్యమైన అంశంతో ప్రారంభించడం నాకు చాలా చాలా సంతోషంగా ఉంది భవిష్యత్తులో కూడా పిఆర్ సర్కార్ గారు అమలా గారు ఇట్లాంటి బాగా సమాజానికి ఉపయోగపడే కొన్ని ఇట్లాంటి ముఖ్యమైన కార్యక్రమం మరీ ఎక్కువ ఉత్సాహంతో మన రాష్ట్రంలోకి తీసుకువస్తారు అని ఆశిస్తూ వారిద్దరికి చాలా మనస్ఫూర్తితో నా హార్దిక ధన్యవాదం తెలియపరుస్తున్నాను